Hit this engine. Oh. Mm hmm. Hello, everybody, and welcome back here to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on Hopagera on BMNG Drive. We do have a Corolla here. We're going to go full send and see what we can do. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. I'll let you find the description box below. Let's get to it. So like I said, we are on Hopper Gear. We're gonna get the headlights up. I'm gonna get my mouse cursor off the screen. And we're gonna go full send and drift. We do have a silver top motor revving at 1200 or 12,000 RPMs in this car. And we're just gonna drift the mountains here. Oh yeah, then we got this. Definitely like how this Corolla does feel. <laughs> As we almost die. Oh, clutch damage. Definitely loves how this Corolla feels here on Beam and G. Bit of a proper drift car. And a track that I kind of am familiar with. From a set of course of life. Oh man, we're killing it now. Oh, as I said, we almost oscillated into the wall. Oh, oh. no, we loosened up our rear bumper there. Getting into the tight section. Perfect toge car though. Not a hatch. Ooh, we almost took off the front bumper there. All the handbrake. Oh, oh. Crippled the front bumper there. <laughs> a little guardrail tab. Nope. <laughs> BBG, so much fun. Definitely having s loads of fun with this. tight section might be might be a first gear ripper with this car with this engine oh mm -hmm. oh yeah we got some oh we got some suspension damage and everything going on right now did I get caught in the guardrail I think I did just get caught in the guardrail what all right we're gonna get a fresh Corolla there Transmission lock. For the Habakir, it's really tight. Oh, left and break just barely tagging the front bumper. Oh, we got it now. Don't lose it. Nice sure where we are now. Long e-brake drag. Gotta be oh, that's the end of the map. Oh. <laughs> that was the end of the map. So we're going to turn ourselves around here. Huh. Right, get in reverse. Here we go. Man, no worries about the look. I really got to get used to stay in the clutch a lot longer. This game does not like when you get off clutch super early. And we're in the wrong gear. We may have to throw a turbo on this engine. We do have the ability to or adjust the gear ratio, maybe. Overall, we are solid. <laughs> if I do say, oh, if I do say so myself, we're not doing too bad. Not the smoothest, but you know what? 
progression. Now, one thing this game I really wish I had was in-car, like, drift cam. Because, unfortunately, it only... Does not rotate, which is unfortunate. So if it had like a real head motion or something, if there is, let me know down in the comments because it'd be sweet to do some first person stuff here. I figured bringing a crawl out to it. It's okay, run. Oh, we don't need that bumper. Or that bumper. We made cheats so much fun. With the damage and everything. Ooh. We're back to the part I know. No, steering lock was not there. We do have the drift suspension or the drift steering on this Corolla. to go through and finding out how to modify cars oh hmm kind of a drift missile now we're gonna finish up this hopping air run oh we didn't need that bumper or trunk that aspect. Ooh, little wall scrape. Surprised you still have an exhaust. Overall, we haven't totally killed the car yet. Except for that one time we got stuck! Oh. <laughs> oh, BMG. All the fun with this. Please use clutch. Okay, I got it. Not sure where we're going up this way. Is this way? I never drove this way in a seto. We just trying to. If I knew this road, this would be so much better. We may need to add a little more power to this Corolla. Ooh, a little wall tap. Very narrow section. Of course, we haven't popped a rear tire yet done it before ouch we meant to be definitely not an easy game to drift in but found this car is oh, a lot nicer than some of the other drift cars oh Remember the, the turbo drift curl? Ow. We tried in the other episode. The same whoop, car total, just not as uh, aggressive. So nip, we're dead. Oh, we're just ping ponging now. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. I think we're going to spawn this car back at home. And then we're going to try one of their factory drift cars. Grand. This car has actually been one of my favorite cars that is currently in the game. 
And I wish I could load my previously saved vehicle, but for some reason it doesn't want to load my previously saved vehicle, but... Little V8 to end this episode off. This is much bigger. This is going to be a lot harder. Uh, I don't think the steering lock is this much. All the left foot brakes, though. Oh, 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 I think we bent our wheel. I think we definitely bent that rear wheel on that curb. Did this much nicer with the Corolla. Definitely more comfortable in that Corolla. If you guys want to keep seeing Beam NG here on the channel, let me know down in the comment section down below. One of the hardest games I feel to drift in. But also one of the most fun and most satisfying games. With the damage and everything like that. We're going to have to try and get online and do some online drifting. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media. All that you found in the description box below. Final down rundown on Hopgera. Oh, popping a taillight. No big deal. Got this. Now we're flowing. Oh, as I say that, we, we go hard into the guardrail and uh, crimple in the back a little bit. But nothing major. All right, we got this drift missile going. Oh, we're dead. Oh. <laughs> so I think that'll do it here for this episode. Here on Beam and G, we did just lose our rear wheel. Um, it went off the mountain. So, with that being said, like thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.